there's an important principle that we follow in all charisma school training, which is the principle of cumulative effects. This is nothing more than the understanding that throughout our lives, we collect the cumulative effects of everything that we do, our habits, our mindset, our feelings, our actions, behaviors, they always add up over time. This means that the cumulative effects of bad habits, bad thoughts, useless routines and behaviors crystallize their effects in your mind, body and energy, and you end up being the sum total of all this. If you think about it from a diet standpoint, there's nothing wrong in eating junk food once or twice. The problem is when you do it so often that it adds up over weeks, months, years and decades. What's the cumulative effect of eating junk food every day for 10 years? How would your body look and feel? What kind of problems would you bring? This is not only related to the physical and diet standpoint, but it's also related to the mental, emotional and energetic standpoint. Keeping bad thoughts in your mind, keeping a distracted and unfocused mind, browsing the internet and Facebook at every free moment that you have, over months or years, what message is this sending? What are the cumulative effects? As you might imagine, not very good ones. Your mind tends to transform slowly over time, so none of these things are important per se if you only do it once. I tend to have some questions of Charisma School students that ask if some particular negative event where they had a weak moment can cast a permanent shadow over their magnetism and charisma. My answer is always the same. If this type of event tends to repeat itself over time, always casting the same kind of shadow, then yes, it affects your magnetism and charisma deeply. If you tend to have the same kind of weak reaction to this particular event, then yes, it affects your charisma and magnetism. If this was one event out of 20 who went badly and put you down, then it's not a big deal. Bad events, bad situations happen to all of us. Now the cumulative effects of how you react to them, this is a bigger problem. If you always have the same kind of weak reaction, then your magnetism and charisma will be affected if you don't change it. If you meet a certain kind of person who have put you down in a specific situation, and if this situation only happened once, no harm will come long term. Maybe you won't feel very magnetic for the next few days, but it will tend to return. But let's say that you meet this person every week, and every week this person puts you down and your magnetism keeps going down. Since it's a repeated event, the cumulative effect will bring your magnetism and charisma even further down. The good news is that this principle of cumulative effect also works with the good stuff. In other words, the good habits, thoughts, emotions, actions and behaviors also transform your mind, body and energy. Develop new concentration habits and watch your mind become very focused. Develop new thinking habits and watch your mind become very magnetic and put you up instead of down. Develop new energy habits and watch your overall magnetism shifting, and so on. The cumulative effects of good practices and habits over years and decades is extremely powerful. One thing to keep in mind is that it's only hard to change these habits and incorporate new better habits in your life in the beginning. Let's say in the first couple of months. Once they are implemented, they reinforce one another and it becomes automatic for you. The good habits of mind, body and energy become an automatic response and they no longer need to be something that you make an effort to do. A concentrated mind can be an extremely great thought pattern that aids your life in numerous ways and all it takes is a few months of effort, then it becomes automatic. And instead of seeking your smartphone to check Facebook or your mail every 5 minutes, your mind will be busy with other more important thoughts for your life and no longer have the same kind of distracted habits from before. So it's no longer an effort to avoid browsing and avoid Facebook, but it becomes a new way of thinking and your mind to behave. The same way with any kind of healthy eating, for example. Once you, in your routines, have healthy eating for all meals, where it's simple and easy to cook and eat this way, you'll no longer crave for junk food and empty calories. Your body just got used to eating healthy. That's why we say it takes as much work to keep a negative habit as it takes to keep a positive and a healthy one. The few months that take to change from a negative habit to a positive one is the harder process. After these months go by, it's the exact same effort to do a negative habit or a positive one. In the same way that one bad or negative reaction won't harm your charisma and magnetism on the long term, considering that it's an isolated event, one exercise or technique won't change your overall charisma and magnetism if you only do it once. It's a cumulative effect of new thought patterns, new actions, behaviors, new energy expansions and so on. 
it's very common for students to have a motivated couple of weeks where they do everything very well, but then you know, they just fall off the wagon and go back to old habits. These couple of weeks didn't do much to change the overall magnetism, energy and mind. So having one week of intense practices, as good as it may be, it's only beneficial for you if you follow through with a continuous change during the next few months as well. Only by having new and magnetic habits of mind, emotions and energy will your permanent charisma and magnetism change. There's really no other way. I understand this goes against the modern seek for the magic pill, where you do something once and magically everything changes. I wish it could be this way, but it's not. The cumulative effect of any kind of training, method or technique always beats the pill that you take only once. It's much better to develop habits of mind, body, emotions, behaviors and energy than to expect some magic pill to do the work for you. And in Charisma School, there are no magic pills, no easy way to change. It takes work, but the work is always well rewarded for the rest of your life. For more information on Charisma and Personal Magnetism, visit charismaschool.com. We specifically have courses which develops good habits of mind, body and energy to achieve great cumulative effect over time. We have a course for personal magnetism, sexual magnetism, magnetic interactions, or the whole magnetic gaze system that is being made available. Visit charismaschool.com for more information.